This video is a quick tutorial on how to download the dataset for Particulate Matter PM10 and import it to Excel so you can create a chart and visualize the data in a convenient way. Open www.uradmonitor.com and go to Dashboard. If you are logged to your account, you will see the stations assigned to you. Open the Data tab, scroll down to the station that interests you, then select PM10 from the list. Select the time interval you are requesting data for. For this example, we'll be downloading the two weeks of data at the beginning of March 2018 from a URAD Monitor industrial unit installed in Slovenia. Make sure the CSV format is selected, then press Go. The download will start automatically. Click the file to open it in Excel. We'll be creating a number of extra columns to make this easier. The first column is the time coordinate for the measurements in Unix time format. It represents the number of seconds elapsed since January the 1st, 1970. In the new column, we convert that to days, so Excel will recognize it right away. We only need to set the cell formatting to have the time readable format. There's a lot of data here, measurements taken every minute. We want to do a per day average, so we create a new column to show the current day. The GMT value will allow us to localize the time coordinates to the local time. We add the GMT to both columns we created and apply the style to all of the cells below. You can copy the formulas we've used in this video. The next step is important. Excel subtotal option will be used to compute the daily PM10 average. We select PM10 to add average for at each change of day. The results are placed after the set of data corresponding to a date. We use the left side buttons to hide the detailed data and only leave the averages. So, we are now left with 15 rows corresponding to the time interval we selected initially. We select them all, then click the chart button. The data shows elevated PM10 values on March the 3rd and the 4th, reaching 60 micrograms per cubic meter. It's easy to see the numbers this way. Hope you enjoyed this video. For any questions, contact us at support at uradmonitor.com. Thank you.